Ugh, why is my arm so itchy? I think I need to go get this checked out. Hi, I'm Dr. Jessica. How am I helping you? Well, when I woke up this morning, my arm was very itchy, and well, I need to figure out why. It could be a simple rash or an allergic reaction to something you used or ate, or it could be worse. The only way to find out is by taking an allergy test or a skin biopsy. Okay, go off, girl. Take the test. Great, Monica. In the meantime, how about you listen to this rap that a colleague of mine made? It's very interesting and informative. Okay, cool. <laughs> Okay, Monica, I have your results, and it turns out you have eczema. What's eczema? Eczema is a skin disease caused by an allergic reaction. It can cause skin dryness with red sore blisters and crusting. Gross. How can I cure it? Unfortunately, there is no cure, but there are several other over-the-counter medicines that you can take. Any type of cord cordic steroid, itch relief product, or any type of lotion or moisturizer will keep the symptoms of eczema at bay. Here, I have some for you right now. Oh, thank you. What layers of the skin does eczema affect? It affects the top layer of the skin, which is the epidermis. The epidermis consists of the stratum corneum, stratum lucidum, stratum granu granulosum, stratum spinosum, and the stratum basal. Wow, that's five layers. How many people get it, and also who gets it? One in 18 people can get eczema, and infants between two to six months are the most common to contract it. However, it is not unusual for someone your age to contract it. Well, just a curious question, what are the functions of the skin? The skin protects us against diseases, it deals with sensory responses, it forms vitamin D, and maintains our body temperature, and also helps in waste exchange. Wow, well thanks for helping me today. You're welcome. I hope your eczema is easy to manage. Quarter zone.